great being the one walking out there, having the home nation back yeah. you up. You can also. I think as well, it's going to be. Uh, because it's your home country, you'll get a little more nervous. Yeah, it's a lot of pressure. You want to you well, really want they, to perform. They have a medal already. Yes. So. This is mega awesome right now. It's I think every seat is filled at the moment. Yes, the, there's so many people in here that you can't fit anymore. The stands are full. Thomas Kearney. Tall guy, tall guy. Thomas Shaw and Bantin Ripo. They're uh, three, great, three great guys. And then for the Ukrainian team, Anton Koma, Nikita Kravchuk, and it was Kidna <laughs> Sehil. Thank you for letting, let, not yeah. letting me butcher any names. <laughs> That's great. So I'm sure that. Uh, but the audience is gonna go wild right now when they're starting to yeah. shoot. That's, I hope the Ukrainian team will, won't uh, be affected by that too much. Because, you know, they're in the gold medal match, so they, they can shoot, they can shoot great. Yes, yes. But Here we see the number first seeded team against the number six. Ukraine coming in at number six in the qualification and France being first. So a good qualification round for France as well. Yes. They've good been shooting great all week. Junior archers at, in France. Yes. Th so this is going to be the last junior team medal match for today. And then we're going on to the seniors this afternoon. Where we're going to see people like... So first arrow up for France. That's a pretty decent shot. It's a nine. Go for gold. Here we see Thomas Koning. He's so tall. That's a little left. That's a ten. Yeah, that's a that's a nine. That's a nine. The uh, the uh, announcer said ten, I believe, but I believe so. But I think that's going to be just out. Yeah. That's a 10. That's a 10. Wow. Must be great if you win on your, your home turf. Yeah. Here we have Ukraine. Oh, a little wiggle on the bow right there during the... Nice shot. That's a nine. That looked like a solid yeah, shot. Yeah, just out. Cool color of the bow, flames or something. That's one of the. It's a little high. That was one fat arrow. Oh yeah. The max diameter of arrows in this game. Oh, they're is they're both shooting them. Yeah. The max diameter of arrows in this game is uh, 23 size arrow, which means it's 9.3 millimeter in diameter, right? I think so. Yeah. So. After three hours each, we have 28-28. Uh, that's a tie game. He's leaning forward quite a lot. Oh, yes, yes. Let's see that as well. We saw so dark. I saw in the technique. Yeah, so right now, wow. Let's, there we go. Koning, looking super solid. And oh, that's a good shot. That's a good shot. Francis on a streak of tens right now. That's a good shot. And it's nine. Yes, that. 57 for France. Let's see what Ukraine can do, how they will respond to this. That's a great look, and he is super solid. Wow. That's in the middle. Wow. What a great arrow. 
He should use that one for a shoot off sometime. Oh if yeah. He, if he if he gets the chance. I still haven't got to see a shoot off. I'm a little bit disappointed about that. Yeah. Especially, sure. especially with the set points, yeah. I think. Oh, yeah. That's just gonna that's, be out. That's gonna be rough. So. Yeah. But I'm sure that's very nice for the archers that they haven't had to do that yet. But there you see the clicker. Oh, Ooh. eight high. Wow. That was surprising. That was in turn after the last year of the Ukrainian archers. Yeah, and now the French, French crowd is going wild again. I can... Uh, it's, it's a similar feeling to when Stefan Hansen uh, won his World Championship medal in, uh, in Copenhagen. A lot of cheering for the French team. <laughs> yes, yes. Similar feeling to when Stefan Hansen won his... Uh, won his uh, World Championship gold medal back in, uh, in Copenhagen. Yeah, a couple of especially ago. when you go for gold in your own country. Yes. There's going to be a lot of people watching. Oh, yeah. Seeing a lot of flags. Seeing some kind of... Uh, some uh, red, white and blue uh, LAD... Uh, I don't know whether it's like lamps or something. <laughs> yeah. Not sure. They're blinking and uh, stuff. Oh, you can see them on the screen right now. Oh yeah, yeah. There you go. One is kind of upside down. Yeah, yeah. They are. Which I don't mind. That's Holland, <laughs> isn't it? Yeah. Oh wow! Just yay! <laughs> Cheer for us. <laughs> see, AG Crane is starting first because they are trading with two points to uh, France. Here we go. Let's see here what we can do for the first arrow in the second end. And that's a good shot. That's, that's a 10. You can see that he's got uh, feathers on his arrow. Oh, yes, of, he did. Um, instead of veins. Veins. And here we've got feathers as well. As well, yeah. Feathers definitely give a more forgiving. Uh, well, are oh, definitely more forgiving than veins because they. Oh, nice 10. It's a great, the great is start. Picking up their score yeah. for this round. Maybe that was just the first end jitters. That was just had to be cleared off before uh, before continuing. So, uh, oh, That's nine amazing. high. And now France has changed their their shooting order again. Well, now France has... We've seen that quite a lot today. Well, mostly by Russia, but now France. Huh. I'm, I'm That's wow. Nice. I wonder what makes them... What, why is that they think that that will, will help towards? I mean, uh, I wonder why, why they do it. Or is it just... A little bit shaky, but it's a great oh, shot. Wow. Solid wow, what a shot. They are not afraid to hit the spider right now. It's those both. So, this was the guy that used to shoot first. Yes, He's shooting now shooting last. Last now. I don't know, I don't think they changed targets, just around it. Just switch the uh, shooting yeah. order around. Yeah. Maybe it was easier for Thomas Kearney, oh, who's so tall. Nice. Oh, wow. There. We still haven't seen a perfect score yet. No, not yet. I think in the afternoon we'll see a lot of those. That's a good shot. That's a ten. Ten. Let's see if Ukraine will go go away from this shooting at 59 or what will happen it's a little shaky. here we have Cyril oh, that's a 9 that's a nine. so 58. 58 is a solid round that's a very good score but we'll see what France will do they've been shooting the really French nice games till now French crowd being loud <laughs> let's 
see what, what they can do. That's a good shot on the second shot. Impressive. You saw the shooting. Yes. Now he's second. What? <laughs> they changed it again. They're, they're just saying it. They're just changing around. it around Val until everyone's shooting yeah. tens. Valentin shooting a ten. And then last up we have Thomas Shiro. Who's uh, shooting the last shot in the second end for France? That's a nice that's just, just uh, out. 58 to 58. Three so that's one. a nice score for a tie. Yes. Both teams shooting really well. That is some uh, some very good shooting from both teams of uh, France and Ukraine in this gold medal match. This is uh, the match deciding on who's going to become the European champions. Now hearing the Ukraine in the background, yeah. trying to... Uh... I'm sorry, Ukraine, but you won't be able to out loud France <laughs> right now. So... Uh, Seeing a, a little block of yellow in the stage in the back. Yeah, yeah, between the, the ocean of blue right yeah. now. <laughs> The ocean of blue, white, and red. So, uh, the energy is through the roof here in Vittel, France. We are, uh, we are sh right now through the second end of our last match of the morning session. Later in the afternoon, we'll go to the seniors, senior team division. And then tomorrow, all the individuals. Yes, tomorrow we'll send all of I the individual matches. Juniors in the morning as well, and then the seniors in the afternoon. Yes. So we'll have the same same kind of idea as today. Same kind of plan. So juniors in the morning and seniors in the afternoon. And instead of teams, it's all going to yes. be individuals. We're right now th starting the third end of the Rico Junior Men's Teams Gold Medal Match. Ukraine is starting off, and uh, he's holding long. This is longer than, this than is what he longer used to than shoot. Expected. And that's a but 10. It's a nice 10. Can't argue with the Sometimes results. Sometimes those seconds pay off. Yes, yes, just to keep, keep, uh, just to calm down a little bit, maybe, just to take a, Another thought. A little shaky. Yeah, oh, low eight. That's, a low eight. That's not what they need right now because France is uh, running away a little bit. I have the only person out on the field right now. And Ukraine changed. Oh, wow. They've changed no, around. They, no, no, they haven't. They're still at the same. Yeah, they're still the same. Yeah. France is France. going crazy. I can just see, I can just imagine the amount of adrenaline pumping through his uh, his body right now. It must be crazy. That's an interesting technique right there. He's kind of letting this go of his third finger before his first two. The other ones. Yeah, that's interesting. That's a nine, so it's, it's good shooting. I think overall most of the techniques are kind of the same, and then sometimes you have those ones that... Yeah, just, just do their own. That's a ten. Thing. That's good shooting. Might might, well, might be a nine asterisks. That's what we'll put on that. Taking a deep breath, going for a for a third shot of this of this end. He's been shooting very solid. Yes, and now they changed the. Uh, that's a ten. That's a great ten. Only got one nine up until now. Yeah. So it's They've been changing the order yeah. around a little bit because yeah. now now Thomas Koning is shooting uh, last. I am uh, I am intrigued to know what why this uh, why they do this. Maybe it's just just lineup. as you said, maybe just change it around until everyone is shooting tense. Yeah. Let's see here, what Ukraine can do. That's a good shot. That's a nice time. That's a nice time. That will feel a lot better. Yeah, giving them a little bit of confidence that this might not be over just yet. 
sixth shot on the Ukraine. That's just taking the nine line. That's a nine. Yeah, that's gonna be a nine. That's not what they needed, but we'll see what happens. What happening right now when uh, France is going on to their third last arrows of maybe this end or maybe this match. They can see the uh, two fingers on the front. That's a good, good start. And I think France will agree with me that that's a nice ten. Yes. <laughs> yes. France is being super supportive and super cheerful right now. That's a nine. That's good. Still good enough. They only need a nine, nine to win. Nine to win. No, they need less than a nine they to win. They need less than nine. Depends. Yeah, it depends on the asterisks on the uh, nine for Ukraine and France if it's out and in. Let's see how he does. Oh, it's a ten. <laughs> Wow. So they, France is taking home six goals in their own country. Absolutely fantastic team by France. France is the European champions in France. In the south. The crowd Everyone's is going. Everyone's standing up. The crowd is going insane. Wow. It's, uh, it's absolutely insane right now. Congratulations to the team of France. Thomas Koning. Valentin, Valentin Ripo and Thomas Schirol on being European champions here in Vital France. And of course the Ukraine for silver. Yes. Great I mean, qualifying as six and getting those silver medals is also very...